her relationship with her boyfriend. You know, everybody has their own drama. Pedro and Chantel seemed to be doing just fine in the family Chantel until everything came crashing down when Pedro filed for divorce and now he's been spotted on vacation with two interesting women and you'll never believe who they were. After filing for divorce from Chantel a few months back, there has been non-stop rumors about Pedro being in a relationship with multiple women, and these rumors just keep on getting crazier, and Pedro has been seen out and about with so many women, and now it's kind of getting hard to keep track of all the women he's been spotted with. Recently, he was caught vacationing in Peru with two of his co-workers, Antonella and Laura, and yes, the same Antonella who everyone thinks he cheated on Chantel with, and I have to say, this was a pretty weird sighting. And I mean, for someone who claims to have nothing to do with his co-workers but working, he seems to be spending a lot of time with them. And like, spending most of his free time with them isn't enough. He now vacations together with them. And what's really strange is, aside from Antonella and Laura, no one else from Pedro's office was seen on vacation with him. And so was this really an office trip or was this something else? And to make matters even worse, neither of these women has done on anything to help reduce the rumors that are spreading about them and Pedro being in a secret relationship, and their silence keeps making the rumors worse. Antonella has been quiet about everything right from the start, and that's weird if you ask me. And I mean, if you aren't involved with Pedro and everyone keeps saying you are, why not just clear the air and let us all know the truth? But she's been so relaxed, it's just like she's letting everyone talk and spread these crazy rumors on purpose. And if you were to ask me, and so many other people. Antonella might just be using Pedro to get fame, and if you think about it, it actually makes a lot of sense, but that doesn't make what she might be doing any less disrespectful than it is. She knew Pedro was married when all this started, and she never tried to do anything to make sure that there was no misunderstanding in her relationship with him, and even when Chantel told her about how her relationship with Pedro was making her feel, she didn't even take Chantel's feelings into consideration at all, and now as crazy as this might sound, there might be a reason why Antonella hasn't said anything so far, and this doesn't involve fame. Some crazy theories have been spreading online about how Pedro isn't really in a relationship with Antonella, but he's just using her, and he's just using her as a decoy to cover up for his real relationship, and so many people actually believe that the real person Pedro is in a relationship with is Antonella's aunt Laura, and if you think about it, this actually makes sense. I mean, Laura has always been in the picture, but everyone didn't notice her, and not to mention the fact that she's his and Antonella's boss. And if you've been paying really close attention, there have been signs that showed there's something much more than just work going on between her and Pedro. There have been pictures of her and Pedro together where they appear really close and extra cozy with each other. And even though Laura described her staff as her family, it still doesn't make her and Pedro's relationship sound any less creepy. And not to mention the fact that Laura hasn't really been supportive of Pedro and Chantel's relationship, and if we're being honest here, I don't think she ever was, and when Chantel is there, she tried to comfort her and act like a friend, but when Chantel isn't there, she acts like a completely different person. I mean, behind Chantel's back, she'd talk about how she's glad she wasn't married like Chantel and Pedro to, you know, other of her co-workers, and now the second theory is that Pedro isn't in a relationship with either Antonella or Laura, and he's just using them as emotional support since he doesn't have his mom and his sister with him. And then not to mention the fact that some people actually believe that the real reason Pedro wants a divorce from Chantel is just so he could have more freedom. But still, although he may not like to admit it, Pedro's strange relationship with his boss Laura and her niece Antonella is doing him a lot more bad than it is good. And since coming to the United States in 2016, he's worked so hard to get himself to where he is today. And I don't think that anyone can take that away from him. But his bad decision-making streak is starting to negatively affect all that he's been working for, and Pedro created separate social media accounts for both his personal life and also for his business, but since he can't keep his you know, personal life far away from his professional life, people aren't keeping them separate too. And recently, Pedro's business Facebook page has been getting a lot of bad reviews and it's really terrible. His realtor profile now has just two stars out of five star rating 
and you don't need to be a genius to get why, his reality TV life obviously has a greater impact on him than his life as a realtor, and with all that has been going on between him and Chantel, I guess you can say that some people are beginning to transfer the hate to other aspects of his life, and what's so crazy is that a lot of people aren't even hiding the fact that they keep giving him horrible professional ratings because of what's going on between him and Chantel, and Pedro isn't only, you know, getting constant negative comments on his Facebook page, but he's also getting called out for using Chantel, and apparently, so many people believe that Pedro just used Chantel to get his green card, and once he got that, he decided that he had no use for her anymore. I mean, can you guys actually believe this? And I mean, when Pedro and Chantel first made an appearance on Night a Fiance, a lot of people, myself included, honestly thought that they'd be one of those couples that were actually in it for the long haul, and now, a couple of years later, they're getting split up in the nastiest way possible. And what's so sad about everything is how Pedro doesn't even want to fight for their marriage, and I guess, you know, I can see why people think, and I guess I can see why people actually think that he just, you know, used Chantel to get his green card and properly set himself up in the United States before letting their marriage fall apart. And I can also see why some people actually think it's nice that Pedro keeps getting bad reviews on his professional Facebook page, and other people think it's not so nice. And I'm not trying to come to Pedro's defense here, but what we actually see on TV is only the edited parts of Pedro and Chantel's life. We don't really see what, you know, goes on behind the scenes, so it's hard to actually tell where the problem really began for Chantel. Chantel and Pedro, and let's not forget that there are actually two sides to a story, and the fact that Pedro has refused to actually come out and clear his name just makes him look like the bad guy. But what do you guys think is the real start of Chantel and Pedro's problem, and do you guys think that Pedro is ever going to come out and say his side of the story? Guys, let me know what your thoughts are in the comments below, and like always, do me a huge favor at that like, follow, share, subscribe button, and y'all better stay tuned for many more videos.